church in the intercession and feel the burden of the people. So who was uh, Eli? Eli in the Bible. Eli. Yes, he was a priest. But he intercedes for persons that come into the temple. And that's why he saw Anna what is deserving. It was a little bit weak. Yes, Bishop. Yes. So some of us got told now um, he's saying that some of us forget to be spiritually, but we need just some rest from this chain. Amen. Jesus, he accessed the three offices, the three stages. Yes, Bishop. Amen. 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 Do you understand the question? Yes, Bishop. So, by the two need more intercessors. You see, people drop up glass in the spirit, check out the choppers, pull out the M16, pass, pop, pop. But we have few that really drop on the ground and catch a bird. Of a family member, of the person sitting beside the intercessors, if they sit beside people that don't deserve them, Jesus Christ. That's the spirit. The Lord begin because that's where they give work. But even though you sit beside the person, that doesn't mean you're going to you're going to carry it. It's just a gift. Because everything went pull. Right? So the Lord will allow you to work. Season up. This oh. season you're free, you can recuperate, strengthen yourself, eat up your food, drink up your strong lips, strong, 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 and fill up yourself with your nerves. You see the next season? We are now Africa come to you. A pastor man in a, 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 a pastor in America come to you. Leadership. It's time to feed so many things as intercessors. Amen? Amen. The prayer warriors are not so. Yes, they will pick up things in the word of knowledge and cut it down, even from way over Amen. But they're not feeling no burden. Amen. They just become bad and war and fight and kick and stop. Shoot down. Cut people loose. Take them out of coffin. Go in the in the bomb yard and in the graveyard spiritually and tell them all that say, Live! Jesus name. Life! In Jesus' name. Praise the name of the Lord. And we have a lot of persons pray for that office. Yes, Bishop. Jesus Bridget. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. No? Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, Bishop. Yes, they call for prayer and time in church on the first of their steps of the church demon. Amen? Amen? Pick it up very fast. We have intercessors that go over into the prayer world and and come back into their own. Amen? Amen? So I'm simply saying all three of these stages have to be governed by discernment and it's that everything that you discern you will touch it. I've been in church here and see a lot of warfare. And the persons that really carry the warrior anointing, they think that they should touch it. It's not everybody can touch some type of warfare. Especially if you're low in the spirit and very young. You can have the gift and feel everything and feel, uh, feel when the person doing it. You feel like you want to do it too, but that doesn't mean you have the gifts to do it. You're young. So what you can do, you just sit down and learn and ask the Lord to, to teach you because he's the greatest teacher. Amen? Amen. Intercessors speak the word. Prophetically. Hear it and speak it. You catch a bird, but you just keep on speaking. If you speak it in the word of God, if you speak it just in straight languages. But if you become in a weeping home, because it's heavy. Amen. And my brother, you catch a burden today for me. Hallelujah. Pastor Gibson. Praise the name of the Lord. So I realize, I realize that since I started teaching, person's office is coming up and giving birth to it. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 
there. We grow on and more because he kept a burden for us this day. Hallelujah. Based upon many strength, the rebellion of brethren, the backsliding stage that they're in, the weight of the ministry. Hallelujah. And trust me, rip it, rip it, rip it until it releases. Hallelujah to God. So we need persons to release us. We have different burdens in one in, in one standing in the gap. You can pick up so many things one time. One fear, burden, trouble, scourge feeling. You know, all different things you can pick up at once. And they need persons to release us. Amen, church? Amen. Any question there? We're going to move into some keys. Hallelujah to God. It's something that I wrote. You said, every season of testing you have gone through, it will allow us to intercede and birth something new. So everything that you're going through, it allows you to intercede. Either pain, somebody may hurt you, may be rejected, you get a bad thing. Whatever you go through, a bad situation, bitterness, whatever you're going through, it will allow something to birth. So you will not go through something with God and don't birth something good. So we don't want to suffer with the devil and birth nothing spiritual. We want to suffer with God and birth spiritual things. Amen, Amen church? So if you're going through, as we teach on the long suffering process, as you go through your long suffering process, you have to burn something at the very end. Amen. What it is, the fruit that you need to burn, or an office you need to burn, but baby, just don't go on like that. You have to travail, you have to feel pain, you have to go through some stuff to burn something because as we teach on the womb, that the womb, spiritual womb, you have to burn the things spiritual that you can manifest them physical here on earth because often times you still manifest in the carnal womb. The old Adamic things we carry, we still burn them. Every day we talk about them, we live in them, we make, entertain them. But now you come in God, you have to allow the Holy Spirit to get inside of you that you can give birth to the spiritual womb. Hallelujah. And then you begin to read the word. And when you re begin to read the word, then come on now, the Holy Spirit will come and live on your side. And you're going to give birth to the kingdom of God. And you're going to activate, access uh, the things of God easily because you have the channel for it to birth. Some of us cannot birth some things because the channel is not there yet. The way is not there for it to birth. True. So you have to have a channel. For the Holy Ghost to come in. Just as though we have a channel for the kingdom of darkness to use us. Yeah. Easily. Yeah. God is looking for a channel inside of you. Eh? Yeah. To direct, to come through that he can manifest himself. But some of us are still manifesting and have the channel of our whole Adamic nature. So it blocks the power of the Holy Spirit to come into your life. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. One, now we now feel not going to burn up the channel black up with their appearance. That is why I believe he gave me some keys and the last topics. So I'll be writing them very fast. I want you to catch everyone. Amen? Amen. And then we're going to pray them. And then we're going to pray them. Pray them two times. So one time as well as we read. And then we're going to pray them. Amen? Any question here? Nothing about it. 
We're moving on. Any more questions? So which one you get the most? Jump over here. Uh, <laughs> some of us don't want it. I put it in the middle because we have to stand in the gap. Yeah. So we don't want to stand in the gap. We want to jump over. Yeah. Give me the prayer warrior. You should go on the Run through the city. And we have persons run through the city and feel no burden. Run through the city and say, Repent! Amen. Come on. I'm showing you because that's your office. But 
if you're praying, me now I listen. Because I have to show myself to this person. Different way than again. And the next time you can intercede when God needs you because intercessor and get up and pray for anything. God give you it. And that is why I said I don't pray as church people. I can't pray rich man. When I get up with you on my bedside and pray. You just stand up in the house. So what is the dream of that house? Assess my vision. The first thing, intercessors, assess your vigils. Then know you're going to um, need a gift of interpretation. They need to pray for that. The moment you got the vision, you begin to interpret. You say, okay, then, this is my assignment. I saw the man on the roof about to jump off. You don't know the man. Then you know, as, as you remember the vision, you better begin. Oh, this is the signal. Some people feel it in here. They feel it. The night is rushing up and down you. That's the assignment. Get down, see him time and begin to pray for the man that just here on the roof. And then don't jump off suicidal spirit. You pick it up. And it can be general. The Lord has raised the suicidal spirit. Release. People are killing themselves. As I, I listen to the news, that couples still know themselves. That's an assignment. Hmm? Suicide. Murder.